right, without further delay, let's get you tonight's tale of the tape. The veteran voice of the Octagon, Bruce Buffer. Ladies and gentlemen, this fight is three rounds in the UFC Bantamweight division. Introducing first, fighting out of the blue corner, Norma the Immortal Dumont. And now introducing her opponent, fighting out of the red corner, Arena Aldana. You ready to fight? Ready. Go right back at the O2 Arena here in London, England, and man, are you royalty around these parts? Oh, I mean, you can barely on. make your way to uh, the John, tonight, John, kid. oh, stop, John, oh, stop, John, uh -oh. please stop. I'm not okay. Okay, okay, maybe in England, they might love the boy DC. And she caught the kick. Nice hook lands by her early. A little bit of extra sauce on that one as well. She felt like she'd be able to get inside and did a nice job to close the distance there. Well, she knew that if she threw it, she had to throw it with intent. That was with intent and landed with a lot of impact. Dumont gets caught by that straight punch there. Jeez, you can hear that. <laughs> Leg kick checked effectively there by Alka. Stuffed the takedown, no problem. Very crafty, finding an opening to land a beautiful punch. She closes the distance and gets a single call. Beautiful timing and placement to land the flying knee. Nice kick there by Dumont. Oh, and there's another combination. She's turning this into a scoring session. Just high volume, and her opponent's got to make some adjustments. The opponent has to make adjustments, but she has to interrupt those combos. When she gets going into her combination, opponent needs to interrupt that when she is this. Free flowing, it is very difficult to deal with. Just misses with a left hook there. That's a beautiful body kick. Norma Dumont is absolutely tagged by that stiff jab. Oh, looks like a cut there. Yes, nasty one on the lip. Three minutes to go. Oh, Dumont's head kick is blocked. No damage there. You know, that's, that's a big thing whenever you're blocking high kicks, man. You cannot just take the brunt of that kick on one arm. You have to get that cross arm to try and guide that kick so you don't take all of it. Great job getting to her position. Right into that single collar. Oh, she goes to the ankle. I don't know if she's doing that because you're in the commentator's booth tonight, but you got to appreciate that effort. Call me entertained. Anytime I get to see something like that, I applaud it. Hat off to you, young lady. Aldana's cut, folks. Nasty cut on her lip just opened up. And now leather being thrown on both sides. Oh, massive kick lands flush. Catches the kick there. We'll see what she can do with it. Oh, you gotta like that, DC. She caught the kick and immediately counters with a perfect takedown. She got an opportunity. As you know, this young lady, every opportunity she turned and uses to her benefit, she did exactly that. Dumont gets up and is back on her feet. Very nice. significant body work here, and these are going to take their toll as this fight goes on. Right, oh, Dumont's eye now closing up. Well, it looked like we were going to get a finish. She had her rock pretty good, but she wasn't able to close the show. She wasn't able to find it. That's as good a body shot as we have certainly seen tonight. That's going to be it. Massive body shot. Massive strike. Great attempt. Great attack. And it landed perfectly for him. Under a minute to go. Irene oh, Aldana gets caught with that punch. All right, so that body continues to get ripped up. The judges are looking for damage and damaging moments, and her body investment has been the narrative in this fight. Early, you may not have been able to see 
how much of an effect this was taking on her. But now you see it. The game plan, everything's clear now. And we'll see her continue to do that as she tries to chase down the finish. 30 seconds now to go in round one. Oh, now gets an underhook to get a more dominant position. All right, so now as the cut continues to get worse, it appears as though it's starting to affect her a little bit. Yeah, it's starting to affect her. You can see it. She, she's reaching for it. She's... Oh, yeah. 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 Still standing, but she gotta get on the right now. She gotta get out from the center of the outcome. Right to the face before she can evade her opponent for finishing it. Oh, Round God. two coming up next. All right, heading back to the corner and Aldana's corner looks a little bit concerned, perhaps because of that cut on the lip that was opened up there in that round. Starting to bleed pretty good. Cut man's got his work to do now. All right, so we will see another round here. Sat her opponent down there in that previous round with a punch. Surprisingly, surprisingly, we are going forward because I thought it was over. I saw that punch land. We started to yell. We started to scream. We thought the fight was done, but we moved forward because her opponent is so tough, but she's so skilled that she can't get there again. You ready to fight? Ready. All right, round two. Good. Oh, oh nice takedown defense. Oh, she continues to punish the body yet again here, just as she did in the previous round. What a block. Well, this is one of the more active rounds we have seen all night long. Both of these women have oh, really had success with the striking, and both seem damaged. It's always fun when you get a fight like this, where you see the blood on both sides, where you see the swelling on both sides, where you see the concern from both fighters recognizing that, wow, I've got my equal in front of me. Let's see who can push through and get the victory. Goodness, back and forth we go. Massive shots being landed on both sides. Madonna's mouth is just dripping blood everywhere. Oh, oh, right right there, you see. Great shot landed. Now she's got a good taste for it down. Able to find that precise range with the high kick. All right, so no surprise to see her continuing to attack that area. That cut is going to get wide. Back to the feet now. Big left hand there inside. Three minutes to go. Both fighters exchange in the pocket here. Well, she has certainly picked up the pace here. And she did not miss there. This could be the end, DC. I mean, she hurt her so bad with that big head kick. I don't know how she's standing. Oh! Oh, she is bubbled now. That's how you block a strike. Well, the crowd continues to react with every passing land, but if you're the referee or even the corner, somebody's got to get involved, I would think. Somebody's got to do something. It's getting very... Oh! Finish, 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 finish. Oh, nice straight punch there by Aldon. Well, you got to think at this stage of things, there is a wide margin on the judges' scorecard. She has landed a ton of significant strikes in what is her best performance today. This is the best we've ever seen her look. She did a great job of fighting at her pace, dictating control in all of the exchanges, and she landed punches and bunches. All right, so just as we saw in the previous round, she is realizing a lot of success with her kickboxing game tonight, and you can see the confidence growing with every strike landing. It's overwhelming for her opponent to be in there with her when she's in this flow state. 
She's so good at everything she's doing that now the activity is starting to pick up. If she can continue to fight in this way, I wouldn't be surprised if this fight gets finished. Aldana gets the takedown. Nice entry on that attack. Well, we try to not get too predictive when it comes to what we're going to see, but I know you're surprised to see this decorated boxer land takedowns at this rate. Well, especially when I'm so hard on her in fights prior. If you learn to wrestle, if you learn to do this, it could be better. You look, she has learned. She has committed herself to getting better. Oh! Well, she's leaking a lot of blood now. That cut is getting worse with every strike land. And the blood is flying. Her confidence is growing. She will continue to try and target that cut until someone has to come in here, ringside position, and stop the fight. Oh! She's getting up. Yep. Thirty seconds to go in round two. Fifteen seconds to go. Dumont's going for the sub here. Oh, compromising spot here. Trying to choke his walk in. Round three next. All right, so that's the end of the round, and she's smiling through it. But, man, the cut on her lip is absolutely nasty at this point in time. you got to think it's upsetting her breathing pattern at the very least. And if it gets any worse, there is an argument to be made that the doctor is going to get in there and stop this fight. Well, she's dealing with a pretty big cut now. We'll see if we can isolate exactly where it happened in that previous round. Man, she took way too many shots in round one. She was not being responsible defensively, and ultimately she is paying for it because now she's having a real tough time dealing with that cut. You ready to fight? Ready. Do Five it. minutes to go. Well, get the bonus checks ready as our next round gets underway. This crowd is going sick and hard to blame them after what they saw in the previous round. They year. are going crazy. These two young ladies are putting on a show. Heavy on the cut. Heavy on the cut. Double leg shot. Oh, and she just ruined her there as she slammed her opponent to the ground. I that hurts your back just watching it. It hurts my back. <laughs> it sure hurts your back. But it doesn't feel any worse than it does to that young lady right. that just got slammed on her back. I mean, she is feeling that. Oh, somehow she gets out. I thought it was over. I thought it was over, but that's one thing you know. Never underestimate these fighters in their submission defense. Well, she went to the straight left, unable to connect. Well, you know about the offense, but how about the defense? Overhand blocked by Aldon. I think she heard it. Back to the feet. Oh, big left hand there. Oh, she works the body as well as anybody in this division. Another. She's in a lot of trouble, John. She's going to have to be so smart to reach the final bell. That leg kick hurt. She gets in very close. She gets to the single call. Aldana's an absolute mess right now. There is blood everywhere. I wouldn't be surprised at all to see them call in the ringside position between rounds. Nicely done as she closes the distance to attain the single collar tie. Staying busy in the clinch lands a nice punch there. Beautiful kick to the body. Just over three minutes now to go in the fight. They're all the way into it, and now this could be the beginning of the end for her opponent. It seems like we are in the final act of the four-part play because this fight is about done. Take a look back at some of the pictures from this one, and she had it all going on tonight, but certainly her boxing was on point. Her boxing always is what allows her to dictate the pace of fights. Finally, she landed the strike that ended the night of her opponent.
All right, we now go inside the octagon. Bruce Buffer has the official decision. Ladies and gentlemen, referee Herb Dean has called a stop to this contest at two minutes, 11 seconds of round number three. Playing the winner by knockout, Arena Aldana! Well, you see the raw emotions and the happiness out of her in her corner. What a result here tonight as she gets it done by knockout. I mean, she could not have imagined that it would go this well. I know she said it would happen.